In this video is a quick presentation of different genre of popular literature such as cartoon comic books, graphic novels, young adult fiction, and children's fiction. What differs from each of these? Let's find out. Hello, Daniel. Got hungry waiting. Helped myself to some beans. Hope you don't mind. Good day. For today, we, I would be talking about cartoon or comic books. So according to the module, a comic book is a sequence of cartoon. And according to Wikipedia, a comic book or a comic magazine is a publication that consists of comics arts in the form of sequential juxtaposed panels that consist individual scenes. And these panels are often accompanied by descriptive prose and written narratives. When you come to different countries, it has different names. Or it can be called in other names. In China, it is called manhwa. In Japan, it is called manga. And in the Philippines, it is called comics, which are often seen a lot on the newspaper. And in Korea, it can be called manhwa. rather than any other ordinary novels because the readers become more interested to finish the story with the use of images. The first graphic novel was published in the United States in 1842 entitled Obadiah Oldback, written by humorist Rudolf Tuffle. Stein's Ghost Month series are some of the best and well-known examples of young adult fiction. Young adult fiction is a popular genre that is being modified into books for teenage readers ranges 12 to 18 years old. This genre is targeted to adolescents and approximately half of its readers are adults in which young adult fiction colorates with the experiences of these ages. That includes strong characters and repulsive storylines like sky pie, romance, crime book, horror, and fantasy. And that is young adult fiction. Thank you. Fiction is a story or a literature for children ages 0 to 10 years old. It is very important because children can cope up easily with the story. It made for children so that can easily understand the story and they can learn a lesson from it. I have here an example of children's fiction. So one of example of children's fiction is a rainbow flower. This story is about a girl and a flower who can make a wish through a flower. So English fiction is very important because it helps children to cope up with their culture and to easily understand the story. So those are some varieties of popular literature. When we say popular literature, it contains certain writings written for the masses and those that target large audiences. Now you know. 